Hey, what's up everyone? Welcome back to another video. In this video, we're gonna be speaking on something a little different off topic that I usually talk about, but I wanted to bring this to everyone's attention. Have you ever seen one of these or these on the internet? These are scamming emails. So if you guys have gotten an email or maybe a text message getting into your computer or your phone, and we're gonna walk through setting up a remote software and showcasing the softwares that these scammers use. I don't normally talk about this, but I wanted to bring it to your attention because I get these emails all the time. And actually today I trolled two of them. So I enjoyed it, I had fun, and I'll walk through the story. So let's jump into the video and still remember, like, subscribe, and share. All right, folks, so here we are on the desktop. So the first one they normally have you folks download or they try to get me to download, but I actually have a Kali Linux VM. So they're always telling me to download the executable, blah, blah, blah. And I actually said, give me one moment. Let me start up my other laptop. And that was another VM. And I had them in an enclosed environment and I was tricking them and trolling them. But, you know, this is not a scam, you know, channel but it's, it is cybersecurity related because people try to scam you or hack you or try to get your information. So the first one here, and we'll install this on my Kali machine. I'll walk you guys through it. And I actually have it installed already. So, but I'll walk you through the, the process. So this is the first one is any desk. If you guys haven't heard of it, it's cool. You know, if you're trying to help your friends and family and I use it for my friends and family, and the next one, which is someone called me today, or I called someone because I got the email, one of these little emails, let me show you guys here. And I blanked out my email, but this was it, 400 bucks, call this number right here, and you know they're gonna help you out. So this was one that was new. I never heard of uh, Supremio or Sup Supremo, whatever, uh, remote software. So obviously, if you go to free download, and you come over to here, you can download for Linux and you can also throw them and all that stuff. So this is how you download it. But they would kept on saying if it's a Windows or a Mac or an iOS or an Android. And I was like, I just don't feel comfortable downloading anything on my phone because I don't know you, blah, blah, blah. But we can do it on my computer. So come to find out, they, didn't, they ended up hanging up twice and I kept on calling them until I talked to someone. And, you know, I was telling them to really cut it out because it's not cool. But anyhow, the next one here is probably very familiar to you folks, TeamViewer. A lot of people use TeamViewer. And there is another tool you can use is Quick, Quick Assist from Microsoft, actually. So I didn't bring that up. So I want to go Microsoft Quick Assist. So it's built into Windows. You can solve anything. You know, you just click on Quick Assist. Obviously, this is not a Windows machine. I'm on my Kali VM. So you just download, or it's already installed. You'd hit Quick Assist, you know, Help Home, and then, you know, you have them give you your six-digit code, and then you prompt for access. But that's it. I just pretty much wanted to make this video and showcase the, the softwares that you can utilize. So for the steps on installing this, since I already have it installed, we won't do that actually installing it, but I'll walk through step by step, you know, I'll just put the commands here. So step one, and I have them here. So always, always just do a little quick update on your machine. So you can do sudo apt update, you know, and upgrade or, you know, the upgradable list upgradable and sudo apt. I just actually have this on a on a cheat sheet, I do this probably every two weeks on my Kali machine, so this is a given. And step number two, we can, I wanna put that command here. You can take a screenshot or pause the video and type it out, or I can also put it in the description. But just in case, if I do forget to put it in the, in the description, you guys can see it right here. sudo apt install software dash properties dash common space apt dash transport dash https dir manager and ca dash certificates g u n p g two space curl dash yes y for yes and the next one we do here is import the import the key 
So like I said, I want to put all these steps in because it will probably be easier just to do a copy and paste. So the next one here is, let me move my head. Let's move this up a little bit so you can see. So it's curl space F SSL, blah, 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 blah. So you can do this for the step number three. And then the step number four, you can get the repository from Debian for Debian. So you can do this command here and echo blah, 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 all this. Like I said, I just got this from the interwebs and I had it in my uh, cheat sheet when I was trolling this scammer. Okay, so let's uh, bring this up a little bit more. And then the next one you can do is install the libraries. And once you once you get that, you can just do sudo apt update, and then you can just type in any desk. And when you type in any desk, let's go ahead and open up a terminal and show it right here. If I just type in any desk, and it'll come up like this. So this should be your end result. And then you can, you know, this is your address and you can give this to someone else and then you can enter, you know, the remote address up here. Okay. So that's pretty much it. Hopefully you guys, hopefully I can just change this or whatever. This is a VM anyway, so it doesn't really matter to me. But yes, this concludes this video. If you find it helpful, if you have any tips for stopping the scammers, I just don't really do videos on scammers because I don't really deal with them. But today was unusual. I just had to troll this guy and he was maybe he just drove me a little nuts. So I had to do it. But yeah, just be careful out there, folks. If you get an email from PayPal help desk support or whatever, like I showed you guys the image or any kind of Amazon or any kind of text message, please don't click on those links. And if you want to call them to troll them, join the fun, but don't call them and give them your credit card number or tell them to connect to your computer because what they're doing with your computer, they can be downloading files, they can be connecting to your machine and maybe corrupting files. You never know what their intentions are, if their intentions are malicious, either or it is malicious to steal someone's money or just to damage their machine. And there is a cool, awesome, awesome YouTuber, Pierogi. I love his videos. He really gets into the nitty gritty of trolling them with his voice changer and all that stuff. But like I said, just be safe out there and please like, subscribe and share. Let's keep growing and I'll see you in the next one.